In today's Minecraft video, I'm going to be showing you how to stop time like this. Welcome back. My name is Echo. This is my new best friend, Bob. He's gonna also be taking part in today's experiment. So I've actually checked out an add-on very similar to this in the past, which lets you completely stop time there and then. But that was all done with commands. This one is all done with an in-game item. This can stop blocks, projectiles, mobs, entities, you name it, it can stop it or resume it. This was created by AMGamer766. I'll leave a link down below as to where you can check them out and also a download. All right, let's get rid of this. We don't need it for now. You can actually craft this in survival. And like I said, you can stop time, entities, projectiles, weather, and so much more. You can actually do this in your survival world if you wanted to. And of course, you can mess around with it in creative. We're going to mess around with both in today's video. So in order to craft this in survival, you're going to need one eye of ender, one, two, three, four clocks, and one, two, three, four blocks of gold. So it's a little bit pricey to get, but not too hard to obtain. So first thing we're going to do here is we are going to actually craft this ourselves. So we go inside the crafting table. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. And then boom. And then this is your... Um, clock. Now, what I'm going to do here is we have an iron golem. Really close to him, summon a ravager. Forward slash summon ravager. We are going to stop time, okay? Listen, you and you, you're going to be friends. All right, stop beating each other up. Well, dude, it's so cool looking at the actual iron golem stance. Like, he is, he is looking at him in the eye, man. They are not breaking contact. And then it's like, bam, bam. <laughs> uh, but the thing is, though, if you stop the time when they're together, hold on, hold on flick, it, flick them in the air again. Oh, 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 we froze them in time in the sky. Yo, that is my favorite thing ever. All right, you ready? Ready, angle? Are you ready? Three, two, one, boom, go. <laughs> it's awesome. You, wait, can you stop? Oh, can we stop bees? Oh, we can stop bees there and then too. So you can stop villages. You can stop the growth of crops, cats, pigs. I'm curious on the Wither and the Ender Dragon, so we will try that in today's video. It's one of the coolest add-ons. Now, unfortunately, when you hit escape, like, you can't freeze time. One of my favorite things about Minecraft Console Edition and Java Edition is when you went to this menu, you can stop time. Now, interesting thing here, right? If we resume time, the day is going to continue to resume. If we stop it, it stops, right? The only thing that doesn't change is your clouds. Maybe you've got this add-on installed, right? You're doing your things. You're tending to your animals. It's like, quick, mother's called me. It's tea time. You got to stop. You got to stop there and then go and do what you got to do. Everything's fine. And then you can come back and continue where you left off. Now, if you're in creative, just head to the bottom. There is three different uses here, which is a little bit strange. Now, you, these two, of course, you only need one of these, right? You don't really need the resume and the stop because all this is is just a different item. But as you can see, it changes. When you use it so you only need to get one this one is time stop players it zooms in and it zooms back out but i can still move so this could potentially be for players who are in your minecraft world uh i i, I couldn't tell you I, I couldn't tell you with that one so unfortunately i, I got no friends so I, I i can't tell you we got a couple of projectiles and items here that we are going to test out and also my mega machine over here like i said you can stop arrows as well which is Insane. We will go with this to start off with. End of pearl, right? Throw it in the air. Let's wait for it to come down a little bit more. Let it come down a little bit more. Let it come down. Bam! Stop. Oh, I'm using the wrong one. Let's get the uh, the other one. You want just a regular one here. Okay, let's... And then we zoom. Come on. We zoom. It stops and teleports you. So what happens if we, like, throw a few of these? Right? I'm going to throw a couple of these. I don't know how many we're going to be able to throw, but we're going to stop time before they all hit. Okay? So we should technically move over there and then like one, two, three, four. Let's see what happens. Resume time. Teleport, 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 teleport. So it's really, really cool. It's super, super cool. And the likes of your eye of the enders as well. Like you can just be like, no, stop. 
stop for a second. They will pop off and they'll also stop in time. This actually just ruined what I want to show you inside of here. But nonetheless, and then it's like, bam, resume. They come back and you can pick them up as normal. And the same with arrows as well. We're going to fire a couple of these in the sky. A couple of these. Going to wait for them to come down a little bit. And then we are going to stop time. So they will stop there and then, right? They'll stop there and then. And then when you resume it, they're just going to drop all at once, right? So watch this. Ready? Go. Bam. They stop all at once. But you can stop things like this. We've got a machine over here, right? So we'll activate this for a little bit. We're going to activate it. Got a couple of these firing out. Got a couple of stop there. But they will stop here. They'll keep firing, but they'll stop in time. And then they'll stop this machine. They won't, they're not going anywhere. There's nowhere for them to go. And then you just hit resume. And they all stop. It's like, it's like the matrix. It's like he stopped everything there and then. I absolutely love it. It's brilliant. Wait, they just spawned. Now, even your tridents can be stopped. So we're gonna have to, hold on, we're gonna throw a couple of these. Throw a couple of these. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Ready? Stop. <laughs> you can see them in the sky, and then we continue. It's gonna fall here. If I was to grab myself a husk, it can't go anywhere. We're gonna resume time. Let's see if my, uh... Oh, it just missed! We're gonna resume time. Oh, it's so close! Alright, come on. Get him. Yes! Yes! There we go. So you can stop the projectile, and when it falls down, it is gonna kill the mobs. All right, let's try some eggs. So you can throw a bunch of these. We can throw a bunch of eggs. Let's wait for some of these to come down. And we stop and we resume. And then we stop again. Oh, it's so close. And then we resume. And then we stop again. And then we resume. And then you end up with a bunch of chickens. But it gets so much better than that because you can actually do with TNT. First thing I want to show you though is like, as you guys know, if we light this and we just watch this because this isn't a wood variation, you know after a certain amount of time that the flames are going to uh, extinguish, extinguish themselves over a period of time. Now I'm gonna wait for this to run out. There you go. If we do this again and we completely stop time, this thing for as long as we're in this Minecraft world is going to stay there. The flames will stay there because you stopped time. Not sure how useful that could be, but that's how it works. But let's say you didn't like the person who lived in this house and you were like, all right, I'm, I'm gonna blow up your house, okay? Yep, as, as casual as it is, we're gonna blow up this house and we light this and we light this. We can actually stop the primed TNT. When it explodes, it just completely disappears. Now, if you're quick here and you throw a couple of these in the sky and then freeze it, you can actually freeze them in time. Okay, so we can summon a wither we can stop the wither. It still has the loading bar. But when it explodes, it will still explode. But he's kind of stuck on the spot. And then we can resume. And then we can stop him again. Yeah, you get that witch. Right? Get that witch. No? Nope. You see friends with the witch. You can see the projectiles. I'll stop right there. And we resume them again. And then we stop him again. I feel like I have so much power. I feel like Thanos. What about an ender dragon? There she is. A beautiful ender dragon. Can we freeze it in time? Bam. Yes, we can. We can freeze the ender dragon. In fact, like you can see how much the ender dragon is fighting the freeze ability compared to everything else. So you can freeze it, but it seems to be like the only mob that can fight the freeze. Which is actually really, really crazy. That's super cool. I didn't think that was gonna happen. I generally think this is my favorite freeze time. Like, look how close these guys are. Like, he is ready to swing, swinging, freezing, swinging, freezing, and then let's do it again. Get him. It's super cool. I'm pretty sure there's gonna be some really awesome things you guys can find out with this. Go and give it a go. Shout out to AM Gamer for making this. I think it's pretty cool. All by the tap of a button.